Sabi ko Ibisco episode 7. <laughs> Kaya pala nando si Pao. She was totally convinced na kinidnap ni ni Bisco si Milo. This commotion um, gave all the time in the world for the pipe snake to retaliate. This thing has two heads from on both ends. Okay? One one head for each end. Tapos sa mga paa niya, it consists of human fingers and feet. One of the most disturbing creatures I've ever seen in an anime, okay? Milo and Aktogawa were able to jump off the pipe stake, but this monster retaliated. Um, parang parang ang palakay. Eh. Naglapas na dilang ganon, pinalot niya rito sa isang pincer ni Aktogawa, so hindi na sila makakawala. Milo had no choice but to cut uh, that pincer, that, uh, that pincer, yung pincer ni Aktogawa yun. He had to cut that off. Para na makawala sila. Then, they were on free fall mode. Bisco attempts to rescue Milo. But, he was able to do it. But, the pipe snake eats them. Well, eventually, they got out. The only way they know how. Mm. Patubo ng kabutin ng bunganga. Ayun. Not only were they able to get out, they also were able to kill the pipe snake. So they were able to get the rust, the legendary rust eater, ang sabi ko we. Eh, hindi alam ni Bisco kung paano, paano, paano magiging effective against rusting to. Nakamakan ni Milo yung, yung sabi ko we na gano'n kasi medyo nag, got, him, he and Bisco got into a verbal argument again, and, uh, natulak siya ni Bisco, then, napa ganun siya sa, sa sabi ko we. Napansin niya, na, biglang umilaw, yung sabi ko we. He just deduced na, there's something about Bisco's blood, on his glove, that made, that made the sabi ko we react. So, I mean, hmm, ginanon niya ulit, umilaw, Minutes later, he was already synthesizing a um, uh, a drug based on what based on his findings. While Milo was working his magic with uh, with, 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 with his findings, in comes Kurokawa with his huge airship. Kinuwang ganon yung yung bangkay ng pipe snake. So, eh, syempre, eh Siyempre, papalag sila Bisco. But, he shoots Bisco with a gun that has, uh, that has rust, that has rusting bullets for ammo. The three decided na, um, si Pao, babalik na sa Imihama, at bibigyan ng, ng, uh, ng, yung bagong gawang gamot kay Jabi. And sabi niya, well, if it works on him, I'll use it as, I'll use it on my, I'll use it on me as well. Ngayon, pinaubaya niya kay Bisco si Milo. In, uh, wow, alright. By, by hitting on Bisco? <laughs> so eventually, bumalik sa, bumalik sa home base niya si Pao. But, she found it empty except for one guard who nagtaka siya kung bakit bakit siya nilabanan nito. Yung pala, ando na pala yung mga tauhan at si, yung si, Kuroka, si Kurokawa at ang kanyang mga tauhan. You know, the bunny faces. Yep. The bunny heads. Yeah, I can, I can call them the bunny heads. Hostage nila si Jabi. Nagtaka na lang si Bisco kung bakit. What? So, why is Milo trying to poison me? Before Milo could actually give him a full explanation, na gets na ni Bisco. Okay, sige. The, the next watch base is not far from here. Ako bumunta doon. Well, to my surprise, Milo uh, is doing his best to stop Bisco. A fight ensues. But Milo wins. Kasi, 
Tinurukan niya bigla si Bisco ng pampatulog. Final scene. Well, he's already put uh, Bisco in a uh, sa isang sopa. Siyempre, nakahiga. Ano ng kumot. At sinabi lang niya, ako nang bahala sa kapatid ko at kay Jabi. Ooh. Anyway, we're gonna break this down. Critic sub style. Okay, mga ka lifestyle. Pace. The only time the pacing went slow, ah, went slow, was during yung aftermath ng ng crisis regarding the the pipe snake when it was alive, okay? And nung um and during that hunting sequence nung when Milo was trying to to hunt uh, to, trying to hunt for food to forage for food yun ang nahuli niya isang baboy ramo sarap nun <laughs> the rest of the episode tense fast paced kasi every time okay ito itong itong power tip ko sa inyo mga lifestyle when watching animes when I'm what when watching animes Every time the big bad of an anime shows up, expect the pacing to be tense. Never babagal ang pacing pag involved na ang 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 pinakataran ang ang pinakatarantado sa isang anime. Sa isang yung pinakakontrabida niya. In this anime, of course, it's Kurokawa. Ngayon, yung fight scene between I don't know if you can call it a fight scene, right? Pero anyway, it's still a fight scene uh, between Bisco and Milo. Was also excruciating to watch. Okay, I gotta admit it's rather tough, tough to watch. Excuse me. Do I have complaints when it came to this episode's pacing? <laughs> Absolutely not. The pacing was well thought. Was well thought of. Talagang it was fast when it needed to be, but it was slow when it needed to be. Flow naman. Well, first gear shift here was the scene where yup, uh, the main protags were able to take down this uh, uh, in in Milo's own words, this dragon. <laughs> this hideous looking dragon called the Pipe Snake. Now, why did I call this a gear shift? It's in um, it was a sort of a mission accomplished moment for for the entire anime. Kasi ito talaga yung dahilan kung bakit nag join forces si Bisco at si Milo. Second gear shift was when Pau returned to um uh returned to base wanted to find out na ah, yun nga. Naghihintay sa kanya si Kurukawa with Jabi as his hostage. Why did I call this a gear shift? Simply lang, mga ka-lifestyle. This completely changes the, um, uh, well, this further complicates the storyline. Final gear shift. Right? It's the final scene. So, aside from uh, the second gear shift complicating the storyline, the storyline, the final gear shift confirms it, right? So, through this gear shift, we can now say that the storyline has just become this complicated. So, these three gear shifts that I saw, all of them will play a role down the line in this anime. Now, I'm not so sure yet kung kung ilang episodes talaga mag run ang, ang anime na to. But, if it's a 12 episode one, we're already in the second half. If it's 13, we're, we're only at the midpoint. We're only at the halfway point. So. There now. <laughs> Plot lies. Um. Tuloy tuloy ang ano eh. Tuloy tuloy ang ang pagkwento ng episode na to. Kaya. Malinis ang plot, mga ka-lifestyle. Talagang, ramdam mo yung sense of urgency ni Milo and how vile an enemy Kurokawa is. 
And of course, yung uh, the sequence where Pao actually hit on Bisco. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I found I found it funny more than romantic. <laughs> eh, hindi pala sanay sa babae itong si Bisco. Okay? If there's anything this scene will tell you, Siguro, but, uh, during the um, during the first few sequences, sinabi nga niya kay, sinabi nga niya kay Pau eh. Oh, oh nga pala, nakalimutan ko. You're his sister. I almost thought that you were his mom. <laughs> Putay na nasad pa. Grabe. So, wow. Right. This, uh, this episode has a, as a really clean plot because I was I only saw one continuity here I only saw one continuity mga ka lifestyle no side stories no back stories not even a flashback sequence Ugh. it's a really clean episode because of the plot so pace flow and plot they all came together for this episode galing so sabi ko with Bisco episode 7 Si Paco. Mm. Two thumbs up. Nicha. Assuming na second half na tayo ng ng, uh, ng run ng, uh, ng anime na to. So, starting next week, it will be the road to the finale na. Episode 8. Eh. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Assuming it's a 12 episode run, ha? So, Things will be uh, na complicated ang storyline eh, dahil um Milo decides to act on his own and disables Bisco in the process. Parang hindi na naman siya baka alam. And he's taking it all by taking it all upon himself to um to uh, to do this, right? Kasi alam niya binigyan niya ng dalawang vial ng bagong gamot si Pao yung ate niya binigay naman ni Pao uh, yung share niya kay Bisco kasi well siguro nasabi rin sa kanya ni, ni Milo na Bisco is already riddled with the rusting at sigurado nakita rin niya yung pagbaril ni Kurokawa kay Bisco and ah uh, uh, rusting bullet yung ginamit sa kanya. So, she has a, she probably has a pretty good idea of how dangerous that kind of an, uh, that kind of an ammunition is. So, she figures na, oi, mas kailangan ni Bisco to kaysa sa akin. Pigil ko na yung share ko. Itong, ito na lang natitira sa akin, kay Jabi na to. So, wow, right? Kurokawa's interference and Milo Milo's decision to act on his own to well, to 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 face Kurokawa head on by himself that complicated the storyline of this anime so tutukan na lang natin mga ka-lifestyle umiinit na ang kwentong ito so again sabi ko with Bisco episode 7 two thumbs up Milo finally, Milo finally has the boss to take matters into his own hands, pero wag naman si Bisco. <laughs> to Patreon, wait for my next upload. And for those of you who are still stuck with the CHD, well, chill-chill lang muna magagawa ninyo. In the...